The Basic Skills Initiative is a statewide program that provides funds to community colleges for the improvement of their basic skills programs. Basic skills are those foundation skills in reading, writing, mathematics, learning skills, study skills, and English as a second language, which are all necessary for students to succeed at college level work. College is more difficult than high school and the expectations are different. So in this program, we try to make it really clear what other college classes are going to require and what the teachers are going to expect of students. So we work on reading skills, uh, writing skills, study skills, test taking skills, and basic time management because uh, college requires a lot of time and a lot of dedication. We have math classes starting at arithmetic and pre-algebra and then going up all the way through the first two years of college math. And I wanted to mention the self-paced program that we have. In the self-paced classes, students can come in and take an initial set of sort of assessment, do some problems, and it'll figure out exactly what they remember from before and then the parts that they don't remember that they need to learn, practice again, review at whatever level. Um, there's a way to get past the stuff that you remember and spend your time on the stuff that you really need. So if you come to DVC and take some math classes, um, think about the self-paced program as a way to meet you right where you're at as a learner. I've been enrolled in DVC for roughly three semesters, four semesters. Two years. This is my third semester in DVC. English uh, 118, 116, math 110. English 96 and 98. I'm in this program to further hone my skills in the area of English uh, for reading and writing so that I can later on in the, in the future be able to do well in college and in general life. I needed more education, I needed more knowledge, I was thirsty for it, so I came to college, DVC. I enrolled to English as second language classes because I have to improve my uh, spoken, reading, and writing English skills. A lot of the basic skills English classes had a high percentage of students with disabilities in them, either recognized or unrecognized. So what I do is I work with those students one-on-one -on -one to develop learning strategies and to connect them to support services in disability support services that they either aren't aware of or aren't already using. Part of what I do is I help the instructors to develop activities to tap into uh, various learning styles and also help the students figure out what learning style would be most appropriate for them and ways that they can study using those styles. Some of the things that, that we work on in Disability Support Services includes the Universal Learning Design Project. So Universal Learning Design is a project that brings adaptive technology such as Kurzweil to all students instead of just students with disabilities. Kurzweil is a program that provides digitized reading text for students. So they scan their books into a Kurzweil file and then they can hear that book being read to them while they watch the cursor move along to each word. They can also take notes about their reading. They can read notes that have been embedded by the instructor on what to pay close attention to. And they can create a study guide for exams among a whole host of other things. The resources that I used was the tutoring center, the labs. Tutors up at the, up the school, up in the math lab, yeah, they do a good job. You know, they help out uh, any questions that I need. I use the note-taking ability a lot. I go down to the office, pick up some notes on my class because by the end of the class, I'm still not done taking notes. So that helps me a lot. I came to the United States and eventually I made it to Diablo Valley College to study in 1991 graduated from Diablo Valley College in 1997, moved to California State Hayward, now East Bay, and graduated from there in 1999, took two years off and then returned to uh, Cal State Hayward to get my master's degree in English as a second language. I returned and started working out here at DVC in 2006. It took me five years at least to go through all the English as a second language classes. Not easy. Even though teachers told me that I knew enough English to move ahead, I just never felt confident. However, that is when 
I met great teachers and they were the best, the best help that I had. I took all the English classes that I could because I thought that by having a very strong knowledge of the English language, I would do well in any other area, and it was right. Yeah, I think I am. I think I'm getting off on the right foot. Yes, I am. I feel much better in my spoken English and my co-workers uh, uh, tell me about that. I do feel that now that I've been taking these classes, um, I am better prepared. My reward is seeing the students' faces asking me, how can I do what you do? How can I learn as fast as you did? How can I move ahead? What do I need to do at this point? Well, one of the things that I tell them is patience. I didn't have it. Now I know what it is. I pushed myself too hard. Okay, you need to relax. See if you can enjoy the classes at the same time. Learned that once we become a member of a class environment and members of a new culture, we have to learn a lot about ourselves again. How do we learn things? We need to learn again how to study. So in my class, I always encourage them. I want them to see me and to say, she did it, therefore I can too. The best advice I could give them would be just to stick through it, um, no matter what you assess in. Don't give up. Um, ask a lot of questions. Take your time. Don't, don't rush into things because rushing ain't always gonna lead to a good outcome. Learn, uh, learn more about DVC, take a tour. You really should just not worry about uh, what classes you have to take or what classes you're in and, and really just work hard on, on whatever you are. Uh, whatever classes you are in because you just should uh, be excited about the opportunity to learn. Diablo Valley College will meet you where you are as a learner, help you discover where you want to go and what it will take to get there. It will support and challenge you on your journey and celebrate your achievements as you reach your goals.